only one way to build a Pokemon card binder on the floor. What is up my Breaking Family? Send in some positive vibes in your direction. Breaking Family, today we are going to officially start building our Champion's Path Pokemon card binder. As you can see, it is a completely empty binder, brand new. And if you're curious, it's made by Ultra Pro. So what we're gonna do in today's Pokemon opening is we are gonna open up all of these Champion's Path booster packs, and then we're gonna take our first official look at the Champion's Path Pokemon card binder and see how many more cards we need to complete the entire set. We all know the only place you can build a Pokemon card binder is on the floor. Is there really any other way? Let me know in the comment section down below, is there anything unique or special you do when you build your Pokemon card binder or when you sort cards? Breaking family, get ready because it is time to open up all of this Champion's Path right here. We have a Champion's Path Elite Trainer box. We also have two of the pin collections right here and we got the famous dub wool box so let's go ahead let's get started opening up champions path we're gonna start with this dub wool box and we're actually going to open all this up and then we'll take a look at the binder right over here as you can see it is put together so anything that we pull in today's pokemon opening we will add to that binder and i'll let you know how many cards I need to complete the entire set, and I highly encourage you to uh, open up some Pokemon cards with me uh, during today's video, or maybe put your binder together today as well. Now we have to pull one of every single card. I do this every single time a brand new Pokemon card set is released. I try to pull one of every single card. Every Reverse Hollow, every Rare, every Ultra Rare, Secret Rare, Rainbow Rare, every single card from the set. I know it's a little bit crazy to try and do that. I can't trade for them. I can't buy them as singles off of eBay. No, I have to pull every single one of them. And hopefully we can add some more cards to our Machampion's Path set. Uh, I have all of my Machamp Hollow Rares right over here that I've been pulling nonstop. And hopefully we can add some more to those as well. Energy! I'll put that right back there. And I hope you are having a fantastic day whenever you're watching this. Al Creamy V, which surprisingly we did not have one of those yet, Breaking Family. So we will be adding this uh, Pokemon card to the binder at the very end of today's video. So stay around for that. Whoop. Right up there in the VIP section. And a reverse hello, Galarian Obstagoon. All right, there's the code card for that one. I will show you the code cards throughout the entire video, just like I do every single Pokemon opening here on this channel. All right, going into the next pack. Already starting off really good. So uh, with a, an ultra rare, you can't complain about that. Roly Coly, Scraggy, Energy. Put that right over there. We have a Lifeguard, Kabo, Rotom Bike, going into a Graplocked V. Are you kidding me right now? Back to back, Ultra Rares. That, that is crazy. Almost looked like that was a, that was square right there. It's not, but it almost looked like it was. Wow. Okay. Back to back, Ultra Rares. There's a the code card for that one. Not bad. Considering I needed that Graplocked V as well. Ultra Rares seem to be hard to pull in this set. Right up there in the VIP section, the very important Pokemon card section. Hopefully your luck with Champion's Path has been good. I'm really hoping it's been good. I know it's rough to pull Ultra Rares or even find Champion's Path to begin with, but there's gonna be plenty more chances. Just wait, be patient. I promise you'll find it. Pokeball Energy, put that right over there. We have Rotom Phone, Team Yelgrun, Arbok, are you kidding me right now? Galarian Cursula, back to back to back. Wow, ultra rares, three in a row. Is this not the greatest double box in history of double boxes right now? And weirdly enough, we needed that one as well. Wow, double, thank you so much, I appreciate it. Whoop. I mean, do we, do we continue? Do we keep going, Breaking Family, because I don't know if it gets better. I don't know if it gets any better. All right, Dubwool, can you go four, four, four? That's a lot of fours. 
Can you go four for four? Double. <laughs> okay, here we go. We have Kakuna Matata, Ekans, Scraggy, Full Heel, Energy. Put that right over there. We have a stadium going into a Rotom phone. All right, Ekans. Four for four. Oh, it's Machamp. Of course it's Machamp. Hey, at least we can add that to our Machampions Path subset right here. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine Machamps from Machampions Path right there. So we will hopefully keep adding to that. All right, let's go ahead and go into the pin collections. That honestly was the best double box I've ever opened up. I think I've opened up three here on the channel, and that by far has been the best one. All right, there is the pin, there is the Dreadnought promo, and a bunch of Machamp, Machampions, bunch of Champions Path. I can't help but call it Machampions Path now. All right, let's go ahead and open these up. I do have a uh, Champions Path playlist right here on this channel, so if you want to see all the Champions Path that has been opened up so far, you can go to that playlist and see everything and uh, kind of follow along the journey of trying to pull one of every Pokemon card from Champions Path. I almost said I'm a champion there <laughs> again. Rotom Bike, Scraggy, going into another Ultra Rare, Graplocked V. This has legit been the best luck we have ever had with Champions Path so far. All right, Grap Locked V, let me go ahead and put you in a sleeve. Here we go. Whoop. I, I honestly can't believe it. We've opened up five packs, pulled four Ultra Rares. This is some crazy, crazy luck. And on a very good Pokemon opening as well, when we're building our Champion's Path Pokemon card binder, good day to be uh, getting some good pulls. Roly Coly! Perloin, Scraggy, which there's three of them in there. They always do that. There's always in groups of three. Energy, we have Piers, Suspicious, Food 10, Altaria, going into a hollow rare Scrafty. There's the code card for that one. All right, our last booster pack from the first pin collection. <laughs> this has been really good. I am smiling just from the luck alone, but you know what's making me smile even more? Because I get to hang out with every single one of you today, enjoy some Pokemon, just be ourselves, have a good time here. Leave the negativity over there, nothing but positivity right here. We don't need no negativity. Machoke going into a back to back Scrafty and another code card. All right. Now, I know we got this ETB, this Elite Trainer Box, that we're going to be opening up last. And I really feel good about the pulls for that one. There we go. There's that. We have our pen, our three booster packs. One, two, code card, and three. And I'm going to set this over here ever so gentle. We'll open these up. As you can see in my background, I do have, I do have that Charizard back there. You might have saw that a little bit earlier when we started, but you know, maybe it might bring some good luck. I don't know. I figured I'd just go ahead and put that, put that Gigantamax Charizard back there. We have Kakuna, Rockruff, Vulpix, Potion, Energy. Put that over there. Stadium, Victini, Swablu. <laughs> Three Hollow Rare Scrafties right in a row, but that's not the most weird thing that I've seen so far with Champion's Path. Uh, the Pokemon Company actually sent us a box full of Champion's Path last week, and we opened it up right here on the channel. And one of the pin collections, uh, every single rare inside of the pin collection was a Machamp. It was pretty crazy, so you can go back and watch that. Uh, it was last week. Energy, Machoke, Piers, Malamar, Rockruff, going into a hollow rare Altaria. Now, in yesterday's video, which you have not seen uh, after today's video, go and watch it. I'll link you up at the very end of today's video. But... Uh, there is a new Pokemon mystery box available at Walmart, and uh, it's called a Halloween kit. It is Halloween themed. Uh, it has a, a, a Pokemon Halloween item in it. it. Has some Pokemon cards in it, um, but a very interesting Pokemon mystery box. So that was yesterday's video. So go check that out. Let me know what you think of it. Scentiscorch. 
I, I want to know, would you buy it? Would you buy it? Uh, because it's a little, it's a little rough. That, that opening, that opening of the boxes, uh, we opened up some other stuff in that video, which insane good pulls, but the boxes itself, a little, a little rough, a little rough. All right, we have our Elite Trainer Box. I'll set that over there ever so gentle. I'll set that over there ever so gentle as well. And then there and everything right here. You can see everything's very organized right here on this channel. <laughs> I'm just being myself, okay? I'm just having fun. That's what we do here on this channel. We just have fun. We don't try to impress anybody. All right, we have our Charizard promo, which is the one that everybody is going after. I mean, one of the, the Charizards that everybody is going after right now. We have our 10 booster packs. We have this right there. We have our dividers, all the energies. There's the dice. Beautiful, beautiful, lovely, and the counters. I already showed you the sleeves, right? Okay. Here we go. We have 10 more booster packs in today's Pokemon opening to see if we can pull some more cards for our Champion's Path binder. All right, here we go. Let's see what we got. Now, I know the Elite Trainer Boxes have been pretty lucky, but now since I've said this, it's probably not going to be lucky. <laughs> we have an Energy right over there. Rotom Bike, Great Ball, Kaboo, and yes, another Machamp. All right, we'll set it with our Machampion's Path right here. I think we're at a total of 10. Correct me if I'm wrong down in the comments. If you are new here to the channel, thank you so much for taking the time out of your busy schedule to come check out this channel and uh, give, give it a chance. Hopefully you'll hit that subscribe button, become part of the Breaking Family, a positive community that we have here. We don't want no negativity, only positivity right here, just being ourselves, just having fun, just having a good time. Energy, I know I'm weird. I know I do things in a very unique way here on YouTube, but... That's me. That's me. That's what you get when you come here to this channel. You always get just me. Whew. I'll set that right over there. I love that sound. I love, love that sound. Okay. What do we have next? We have Potion, Carvana, ooh, nana, -na, Weedle, Pokeball, Energy. Right there. Ooh, that came right back at me. Machoke. Going into Team Yell Grunt, Suspicious Food 10, and a Full Art Dreadnought V Max. Beautiful, beautiful card. Loving the background on that one as well. They are getting better and better with this Pokemon artwork every single set. I'm like, how do they top it? And then next set comes out, and then boom. They do an even better job. It's, it's absolutely incredible. So look at this. One, two, three, four, five. Five Ultra Rare pulls so far. This Champion's Path opening treating us very nicely today, and I appreciate that very, very much, since we are trying to get one of every single card. Potion, Trubbish, Roly Coley, Kakuna, Energy, right over there. Sharpedo, we got ourselves an, an Arbok. Going into a Venusaur V, it is a river of ultra rares today. It does not stop. I mean, you see. You see what's going on. It does not stop right now. All right, Venusaur V, here we go. Whoop. Right up there in the VIP section. Gardevoir. Gardevoir pack artwork. Treat us well, Gardevoir. Come on. Give us that secret rare. The secret rare that everybody is looking for. Suspicious Food 10. That's right. Nobody's looking for any other card from this set. Everybody wants Suspicious Food 10. Am I am I right? Am I right? Rotom Bike going into Galarian Obstagoon. I am currently working on another Pokemon room. Uh, you know, you see the studio right here, right? But I'm actually working on another room, it's a collection room, and it'll be a second studio. We're gonna do some some very interesting and crazy things here on this channel. Uh, I wanna bring you something unique, something fresh here on this channel that you can't see anywhere else. And I'm working on that room. I'm working very hard on that room. I hope, fingers crossed, um, have it done by the end of October. 
uh, doing some custom building inside of that, uh, that second studio. So hopefully it'll be done by the end of October and I can reveal it. October 11th is my birthday, so that'd be even better if it was finished by my birthday, but I don't think that's going to happen. Energy. But uh, I have some really, really amazing things planned for you, Breaking Family. Sharpedo and Professor's Research. Hollow Rare. All right, code card. We have one, two, three booster packs left. We've pulled two Ultra Rares out of this Elite Trainer Box, which is not bad when it comes to an Elite Trainer Box. That's uh, pretty good pull rates. Potion. And it's really weird to see trainers as common cards right now. Energy. Hop. Pokemon Center Lady, we got Food 10 going into another Machamp. We are currently at 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 Machamps from Machampion's Path. Two booster packs left. Let's try to pull one more. One more Ultra Rare. Let's make it happen. We have ourselves Ink A, Swablu, Machop. Going into an Energy. You have to do that. That's the rule. Kaboo, Victini, and a Dreadnought V, another Ultra Rare that we actually needed. We're pulling, we're pulling some things we actually need today, and I am not complaining at all. Whoop! There we go. All right, last booster pack. Do me a favor, hit the thumbs up button. Give us some good luck inside of this last booster pack. Okay, here we go. Here we go, and then we will add in some cards to our Champion's Path Pokemon card binder. Kavana, ooh, and na na. And, oh, there we go. There's the code card for that one. Energy, Lipard, Hyper Potion. Here we go. Here we go. Last one. We have ourselves a. Hey, we got to hype it up. We got to build suspense. Here we go, Breaking Family. We have. Of course, <laughs> it's a Machamp. That brings our total to 12. Now, as you can see, I went ahead and took the face cam off so you can see the entire Pokemon card binder just a little bit better. I went ahead and added all the reverse hollows that we needed, which was about four or five of them. And then now we have a stack of ultra rares to add to the binder. So uh, come along on this journey with me to add in these ultra rares. First up, we have Dreadnaw, which is card number 14, and that's gonna come right after Whalmer. So let's go ahead and add that in. Here we go. Whoop. And then right after that, we have Full Art Dreadnought VMAX going in right after that one. Galarian Cursula V is up next right up here in the corner. And then right after that one, we finally pulled an Al Creamy V, which you can put right beside that Al Creamy VMAX. And then last but not least, we do have this ultra rare Grap Locked V, which we'll add there right in the middle. But here is the rest of the binder if you would like to see it. We are missing just a few cards here and there, but right now we are missing a total of 20 one card. That's all we need to complete the entire set is 21 cards. That includes even the reverse hollows. Breaking family, that's it for today's Pokemon opening. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out these videos right over here. I'll see you all in the next video. And I truly love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and high five.